Welcome back to Weekend Getaways. We've shown you where to stay and what to do, but we all know the best part of any trip is the food. I'm gonna show you my favorite picks in Coeur d'Alene to get a unique twist on your morning coffee and some out of this world steak. We're here in downtown Coeur d'Alene at the east end of Sherman Avenue, checking out a local staple for coffee that's been serving up its unique flavors for over 20 years. This is Java on Sherman. Established in 1994, they're serving up their signature drinks seven days a week. The Bowl of Soul is amazing. I literally crave this drink. It's rich, it's chocolatey, it's garnished with a huge dollop of homemade whipped cream, and it's dusted with a little bit of cinnamon and Mexican chocolate. Bowl of Soul for Amanda. Oh my God. This whipped cream is so good, I can literally eat an entire cup of just it. Seriously, I think I'm gonna ask if they'll give me an extra cup of just whipped cream so I can keep adding it to this drink. Just kidding, but this whipped cream is the real deal. Ah, and we got extra whipped cream, so I, I'm gonna do it. Seriously, we're just gonna keep adding it. The Bolo Soul is my favorite, but there's a whole line of signature drinks from the Cinnamon Girl, Keith Richards, Terminator, and more to satisfy your caffeine fix. Not only do they have crave-worthy coffee specialties, but they also have a full kitchen with not your average menu, where they're putting their unique twist on morning staples and afternoon delights. Java has been a local staple for over 20 years. It's definitely a must-hit spot in Coeur d'Alene, and trust me, you'll be craving a bowl of soul too. For a taste of the Old West, I'm gonna take it to the edge of Coeur d'Alene, where they cook everything over real wood and an open pit at Wolf Lodge. It's a rustic steakhouse right off I-90 on the east end of town that's been serving up top-notch steak since the 70s. What separates this steakhouse from the rest starts with the staff. They literally split all the tamarack and birch wood they cook with. They're not messing around. The food is cooked in front of the customers at the pits over an open flame. There's no smoke and mirrors here. It's just real food over real fire. Their cuts of meat can satisfy even the largest of appetites. Starting out with the little dude, it's a generous 10 ounce baseball cut sirloin. Next is the cowgirl. She's just a teeny little 26 ounce cut. And their signature steak is the 16 ounce ribeye, known as a cut off the prime, and it's notorious for its flavor. Mm. This steak is mouth watering and so good. I'm gonna eat this whole thing. Mm. Other local favorites include the skewered shrimp, large Idaho baked potatoes, and a delicacy found mainly out west from Canada to Mexico, but a local favorite here is the Rocky Mountain Oysters, also known as the Swinging Steak. So I've never had Rocky Mountain Oysters before, but I'm here to tell you, so, here we go. Mmm. You know, I wasn't sure what I was gonna think. These are actually really good. I'm really impressed. There's a full menu of items that make Wolf Lodge stand out, along with a full bar to quench your thirst. Wolf Lodge lives up to the legend, and it's a taste of the Old West. It's easy to see why it's rated the best steakhouse in Idaho. If you're in the mood for steak, this is your destination. We'll be right back with Weekend Getaways. It's easy to see why Coeur d'Alene is quickly becoming a world-class destination location. From the lakefront access to the endless outdoor activities, it's attractive for all ages. I found there's a little bit of something for everyone, from my morning coffee to start my adventure, or winding down with family and friends in the evening. I've only shown you a few of the things that make Coeur d'Alene a great short vacation, or stay a little longer and enjoy a little bit of everything. That's all for this trip, but there are plenty of stops along the way. Weekend Getaways will take you with us as we explore the best places to pack in some fun in just a few days. Showing you some great ideas of where to stay, what to do, and where to eat. We'll see you next time on Weekend Getaways. <laughs> sorry, there was a fly on. I'm sorry. Okay, one more time. <laughs>